Hello friends, welcome back to Reviews by Dennis. Today I got another new to me item that I wanted to bring to your attention. Um, as you know, I usually do a lot of videos on uh, audio equipment, uh, particularly uh, headphones and stuff like that, as at one time there was as many as eight people in our home, so we were always going through different types of headphones and stuff like that, and I, I like to bring uh, the performance of them to your attention. Uh, so today I'm gonna be doing another quick um, review about a pair of headphones, and I wanted to bring it to your attention again. Uh, today I'm gonna be letting you know Know about the Rumi Rock. Uh, this is the uh, True Wireless Stereo Earbuds. Uh, this is the package that it comes in, and I gotta tell you, I've I've said a lot of great things about stereo headphones and stuff like that, and I'm not lying. Uh, I do think they're all great. Uh, they all have their different nuances and features that make them great. But today, I'm here to tell you that I really feel that this pair of headphones or earbuds uh, really steps it up a notch and uh, takes the, the the crown with um, performance and features and just overall quality of a pair of headphones. Um, for one, um, they're very compact, they're, they're truly wireless, so um, that makes it really good in my book. Uh, just from the package, real quick, I'll let you know, uh, it's got a uh, preset EQ on it, so that way you can have customized listening, depending on the type of music you're listening. It's IPX5 waterproof, so you can use it and utilize it when you're doing you know, sports activities and stuff like that. You don't have to worry about getting sweat on them. Uh, it's got touch control, so that's how you operate them with a little um, earbuds, you um, touch them in a, a sequence of uh, patterns depending on how you want to do things. Um, it has extra long uh, play time, approximately six hours continuous play time depending on you know the volume you're listening to that. Uh, it has a U USB charge out, which we'll get back to that because that to me is the greatest feature. Uh, it's got extra large sound drivers, uh, I believe they're 10 millimeter um, graphene, graphene um, sound drivers. So they're really going to stand up in the test of time. And it's just got a bunch of different accessories that come with it that make it great. Uh, it does give you some more information on the back about how it's uh, got built-in lithium ion, uh, rechargeable lithium batteries. Uh, it's charged by DC 5-volt USB. Uh, it's a USB-C uh, charging cable that comes with it. So that's nice that they provided the charging cable for it. Uh, the wireless connections version 5.0 for Bluetooth. Um, which uh, they say the transmission distance, as long as there's no obstacles in your way, is 15 meters or about 49 feet. I actually read an article that said it's actually somewhat farther with version 5.0. It's more like 100 feet, uh, but I haven't tested that out fully. So if anybody knows uh, truly what the accurate uh, level between, like, say, version 4 of Bluetooth and version 5 is, go ahead and hit me up in the comments below just to, you know, spark a conversation. Um, and then it has uh, supported profiles, is A2DP slash AVRCP slash HSP slash HFP. Uh, honestly, I don't know what those different acronyms mean, uh, but those are the different uh, supported profiles. Uh, I guess anybody that uh, has a particular profiles, you'd know what they mean. Um, so that's really it from the packaging. Uh, it comes with a nice sleek, sleek packaging. Uh, when you get it, everything will be nestled in this little plastic tray. Uh, you get, um, it comes with a little cloth to help keep your unit dust free. It comes with, uh, three different size ear tips to go in your ear canal. Um, so I use the ones that are on it, which are the medium size. It seems to work well for me. Um, as I said, it comes with a little dust cloth. This is the cloth here. It's got the little Rumi Rock logo right on the cloth, which is nice. Try to show you that here. Kind of hard to see there. See there? There's the case right there. It's all all kind of dirty. And you kind of it's nice. You can kind of keep it keep it in nice shiny clean uh, condition. And you see it made a big difference there. A little bit smudge there. And then you just clean it right up. Looks nice and new. So it comes with a cloth to help keep it clean. Like I said, it comes with the old, the old uh, C cable. Uh, in case you don't know what a C is, uh, that's the shape of the C. Um, what's nice about it is uh, this will go in either this way or flip it over completely this way. Uh, kind of reminds me of the iOS, um, uh, the most recent iOS charging cables, which doesn't matter which way you plug it in, so that's nice. You don't have to worry about fighting with it uh, like you would, say, a micro HDMI uh, type cable. Uh, so that's really nice. These also work with other things uh, on the market. I believe uh, MacBooks use those as well as uh, Nintendo Switch. And uh, like I said, extra tips. Comes with some tips and some wings uh, in there. And the wings uh, help fill in the, this portion of your ear there to give it a secure lock. 
Um, that's one of the things I wanted to tell you about these headphones. You can actually wear them three different ways. You can either wear them just the buds in your ears. You can wear them with the little wings on it. We'll give it a secure lock. And then you can also wear them with the sports uh, tips that come with it. And the sports tips are actually housed right on the bottom of the unit. As you see, they just simply come right out and like this and you're going to put them over the earbuds and then they go over top of your ear personally i per prefer these particular types of uh um type of wearing earbuds my uh most favorite pair of headphones that i use i actually use them because this is the kind of um uh ear comfort level that i use i use that um the sports tips on them it's just i like the way it feels on my ear i feel secure that it's not going to fall out and uh it's just something i've come to really uh value and like uh, so anyway, here's the case again with the Rumi Rock logo on the front there and when you open it up This is what it looks like. They're labeled left and right. Uh, it's telling you that they're true wireless stereo and when you pull these headphones out Pull them both out there. They're gonna come on automatically and they're gonna pair to each other uh, As you see in the bottom there see those little three uh, brass or copper uh, colored spots there. That's what charges them on the back side here. You see see if I get get the light the right away so they make connection with there and that's what makes them charge uh, what's nice about this case this case is actually the charging unit for the buds uh, the buds will uh, let me just put one of these in here and that's what they look like and the buds uh, will charge when you put them in the case automatically and when you take them out that's what um, starts them starts them to come on and then obviously the charging stops um, what's really nice is uh, I can't hear myself properly there I'm just gonna set them down what's really nice on the side you have a little power indicator spot you push that button and it'll show you what the power level is there's four little lights that'll come on and then on the back you got a little grommet that covers some housing information and on the front here or on the back left you got an on off switch I'm going to turn that to on I have it on off right now to save power and once you turn it on on and you push that button on the side it shows you your power level as you can see all four lights are lit up so i know that i got full maximum charge right now and it'll go off after a while just to save energy but if i push it again see it comes right back on so uh it'll it won't come on unless that um power switch is on the on position and then there is the um usb-c charging port uh, like I said, I said I'd get back to this particular part here, the port, uh, USB port out, uh, and that's what I mostly wanted to tell you about as a feature of these uh, earbuds that I found amazing, is that this unit itself will charge your earbuds approximately 16 to 18 times according to the instructions, and that in and of itself is great. But um, sometimes you may find that your uh, particular device that you're listening to, say it's your cell phone or uh, MP3 player or something like that, that might need to be charged to keep up with the amount of time that you're able to listen to it. And on the back here, you'll notice it's got a USB slot. So you can actually charge your phone, you can charge your MP3 or whatever else you're charging with your actual unit because this is an actual power bank. Uh, it's a 2000 mAh power bank at the same time as it is a charger for your actual earbuds. Um, so to me, I've never seen any earbuds or headphones on the market that do that, that offer their unit as a power bank as well. So that's a feature that I feel that this company went above and beyond with to make it so that um, it could be used with multi-purposes -purpose in mind. Uh, the only thing that's kind of a drag, and you know, I'm not going to be negative Nelly here, but obviously if you're listening on an Android, de Android device and you have the micro C that comes with it, that's not going to be compatible. So you're going to have to have an extra wire that goes to the device that you want to charge. Um, to me, that's not a no-brainer. You, you know... I don't know, you tag it along with, with, with your stuff when you're bringing it with you. Um, I don't know, wrap it around the case. Uh, but either way, that's, that's just a minimal thing. It's really nice to have that convenience. Um, overall, I think this is a great product. It comes with all that stuff, plus a really handy uh, instruction booklet. It's not really big, uh, but it is really small print and it has lots of great information on it uh you know telling you you know the different parts like the wing tips that hold it securely in there sports or the different sides that are available uh you know how to set everything up 
you know, in your ear properly and stuff like that for maximum sound. And, you know, just overall troubleshooting if you're having any difficulty with something. The most common troubleshooting problem that seems like people have is to have each individual earbud pair together prior to it connected to your device um, and usually with that in mind you need to uh, get into the habit of trying to remove these from the case uh, together or as quick as possible you know don't take one out dilly dally and then come back and take the other one out because then they're not going to be paired together they have to be taken out relatively you know I don't want to say quickly because it makes it sound like you're racing to get them out but you got to take them out relatively quickly so that they can pair together first to themselves and then you can connect to your device so that's pretty cool um each of the uh earbuds have a little light on it as well as a microphone hole and uh that'll let you know you know different things that it's doing uh from you know from the charge level and stuff like that to being able to pick up you know calls if you're using it for uh voice calls and also this part of the the earbud is the touch control spot that's what you're going to use to control different functions from changing your next track answering calls uh changing the preset uh eqs you know so you're gonna to have to read the instructions to keep in touch with those because they don't follow the standard um uh controls that are on the marketplace with other devices as this one has more features that are involved with uh you know this being uh completely wireless and having so so many overall features so one last thing i wanted to mention too that I thought was a really great thing that goes above and beyond with this company is that it comes with a free one year hassle free warranty. Uh, this little card uh, to me could be a lifesaver. Um, it comes with a one year free hazard free warranty, which, if you have any problems, uh, they give you a uh, email address on the back of this that you would be able to write to to let them know that you're having difficulty with their headphones and uh, they'll usually respond to you within like 24 hours and um, then they'll, um, you know, uh, replace them they'll they'll have you send them to an address that's also listed on this card and uh they'll replace them for you and um it even says on here that the shipping will be refunded so that is pretty good and it shows that they're standing by that product that they're willing to stand by a warranty like this uh again that's a one year free hassle-free warranty and uh i mean just really that's a good deal uh, i don't see many products having that kind of warranty on their on their products so, I mean, overall, I think this is a really great product. Um, oh, uh, let's talk a little bit uh, about sound quality. Uh, they do sound really good. It has very nice low bass uh, tones as well as really crisp treble tones, uh, you know, sounds. Um, the, pre the preset uh, EQs are really nice for listening to different types of music. I like to switch to the um, heavy bass. Like, say, if you're listening to something like dubstep, or even jazz, something like that, it's really nice. Uh, if you listen to something that has those, you know, a little more metal sound, you might want to switch to the uh, EQ that has more of a, um, a vocal output uh, that's higher than the rest of the music. So you're gonna, you don't want to play with the different EQ settings to find what's comfortable for you, depending on uh, the type of music you're listening to. Um, also, these headphones, which uh, it doesn't say it on the box, at least I didn't see it anywhere, they're also rated as um, 6D, uh, a, a pair of 6D true wireless headphones. Uh, 6D audio is a newer type of sound quality that's on the market, and that has to do with how a uh, particular um, recording was recorded. Um, 6D audio would most notably be said to be a deeper experience in listening, in that it the, the audio sounds like it's coming from multiple sources. Um, the best way to explain this, I tried to explain this to uh, some of my kids how it was, is it's similar to the old-fashioned quadraphonic sound, which you'd hear in your old-fashioned stereo hi-fis, where you have sp speakers in multiple parts of your house, and you'd have music coming out of over here, a different type of instrument out of here, and then you'd have vocals out of the ones coming over there, and then you'd hear almost, you know, like background ambient noise coming from the other ones. It's that feeling, but it's immersive in your head. Um, there was a few songs that I was listening to via um, one of the popular um, video sites, and it was uh, it had the feeling almost like the performer as he was singing the song. It's almost like he was standing in front of me and he was walking around me as he was singing. So it's got a really unique sound and and almost feeling that goes along with listening to uh, 6D quality sound songs. Um, but keep in mind, you're not going to be able to experience that 6D audio sound without 6D audio speakers. Um, just It's just a different way of listening to it. Things sound like they're, you know, you can almost picture where they're at from the way it sounds. 
So that's just something a little extra uh, about these that I wanted to bring to your attention. Overall, I think these are a really great pair of headphones by Rumi Rock, and I don't want you to just take my word for it. I'm trying to give you as much information as possible. I know this is a really long video, but just uh, check out the link I'm going to give you in the description below. Find out for yourself if these are right for you or not, and you know, have a great day. Thanks for stopping by today here at Reviews by Dennis. Take care, folks. Bye-bye.